Welcome to the Freedom Fighters campaign, and this is the first mission, Kerak. Many of Saladin's peaceful oases are being raided by Lord Reynold, safe behind his mighty walls at Kerak. To attack this formidable fortress, however, you must first raise a treasure chest of gold large enough to tempt the local Shah to help us. Kerak is the mightiest of castles, Highness, and we cannot hope to attack it alone. If we can raise the needed gold in time, the local Shah can be tempted to send his troops to aid its assault. The Shah is very partial to gold. Place your stockpile, my lord. Oh, man, oh, man. This looks like such an easy mission, but it kind of isn't. Um, we've got a big, huge oasis. We've got iron. We've got stone. We've got lovely choke points to fend off the enemy. You know, we've got the Shah down here who's going to help us attack Kerak, the, the mighty fortress of Kerak. But there's just one small problem. We start off with three archers and two Arabian swordsmen. And uh, he's going to be sending attacks at us and getting our economy up and running so that we can get some troops out just isn't that easy. Right. Where are we going to put our stockpile? Right, kind of, when you place your stockpiles, don't worry too much about iron and stone. You can always put in extra ox tethers to max out the production of those. It's more important to worry about, like, where your granary is going to be, and especially if you've got a wheat economy, like, like where you're going to put your wheat farms, where you're going to put your bakeries, because they've got to, the bakers have got to walk backwards and forwards between the stockpile and the granary. So, I'm going to put my stockpile, I think, about... about... Um, and I want it. So I want the the, the the stockpile like fairly close to the wood. Yeah, I'm going to put the stockpile about Such there. Your granary, sire. And then I'm going to put the granary because we've got like so much of this area. Uh, I'm going to put the granary. I'm going to spin the granary around that way, and I'm going to put the granary about mm, there. Right now we need to go, 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 go. And the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to crank out loads of wood. Uh, no, I'm not. The first thing I'm going to do is crank out peasants. Peasants. Right, let's bang out some peasants. Lord Reynold is not likely to tolerate our presence here, Highness. I suggest that we get the fences up and running before we start to raise the needed gold. Right, now I'm going to bang out um, wood camps. I just bought a load of wood. I'm going to bang uh, wood camps in here, here. And then I'm going to put wood camps in, like, all down here. Um, okay, get one yeah, there, there, I'm going to put a few over here, I think, yeah, one, two, three over there, oh, and a fourth one, what, like, what the hell, okay, so we've got loads of, loads and loads of woodcutters, and in fact, we probably might need some more, okay, um, how much more wood have we got? The answer is not very much. Right, we're going to put some apple orchards in just to provide some quick food. Okay, now we've got like, uh, we've got 50 pitch, which I'm going to sell. Not enough goods. To raise some more cash, to buy some more wood. Not enough gold. And I'm going to get, uh, huh, what am I going to get? I'm going to get some more hovels in. All right, so we've got some more people. Cool, and you know what, I think, you know, I think we're going to bang in some chandlers. Yeah, yeah, I like that idea. Uh, how am I going to put them in? You know, I think I'm going to put them in a block like this. So, one, two, spin them around, three. We need wood, sire. Uh, come on, woodcutters, where are you? They should be producing wood. Here they come. Come on. Get them in there. Good, good, good. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Right. Now we'll start off with four. Okay. Right, now I want to get... Um, I really want to get some stone production going. So let's get some stone going up here. Boom. Uh, we won't put in an ox tether yet. Same with iron. Uh, spin you around. I'd like to get some iron production going. Right, so that's iron going. Now we're going to need another hovel... So I need more wood. But fortunately, the wood, because we've put like all these woodcutters in, the wood is kind of flowing in, not too badly. But it is going to use up our food supply. Please. So let's cut that down to half rations. And we're going to put in... Uh, we're going to put in just some more 
apple farms. One, two, three. Come on, wood! Wood, wood, wood! Look, look at all the wood flooding in. And the more wood they make, the more wood I don't have to buy. Which saves us a lot of cash. Right, so we've got more... Got more food coming in. So now we can afford to put, like, another hovel in. We've got peasants. Right, now we need to start thinking seriously about, like, our defences and stuff. Um, right, stone. Let's put ox tethers. Alright, now, how much wood have we got? Not a great deal. Right, come on, start bringing this stone in. That would be really good. Uh, we need more wood, more wood, more wood, guys. I really don't want to sell the stone at this point. Let's get another quarry. Uh, oh yeah, that'll fit in there. Right, so we'll get another quarry going. We've already got one ox tether there. You know, I'm going to put one more in. No, I'm going to put two more in. What the hell? Uh, okay, what else? What else? What else can I do? Um, I'd like to get, like, wheat and stuff going, but, like, right now, hmm, I'm just going to sell these candles off. Not enough good. Raise some cash. We need to put in a ho uh, not a hovel. We need to put in... <laughs> what are we doing? We need to put in a mercenary post to get some troops. And I want it kind of as close to here as possible. So, you know what? I might even put it up here. It might not be the worst idea in the world. Yeah, because I can churn the troops out quickly. Right, so we're going to need to put some uh, defences up here. But for that, we're going to need stone. And we're going to need, like, quite a lot of it. So let's get more stone production going. Let's put one there, one there, Not one enough there. workers available to run this building. One there, right. So what did I put? I put in six. So we need ox tethers. Um, four. I need five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve ox tethers for six of those. We need more hovels. Right. Let's get some more hovels in. Come on, give me wood. Give me wood. Cool. Right. And as soon as possible, we're going to need to start... Has sent out a raiding party to test our defences. Oh, you've enemy got attacking. to be kidding me already? Okay, we're getting some stone in place, but... We don't have any troops! Like, not even close. We can sell these not candles. But without a defensive wall in place, we are just, like, totally screwed. Um, we can sell the wood. We can sell the, those few candles. We can buy a bit more stone. Right, what we want to put in place is... Um, I want to get a nice grand tower, like, up there. And um, just put in a... We'll just put, like, in a curtain wall for now. Because, like, that's all we can afford. Like, we can't even afford that. Come on. Give me some more bloomin' stone. Okay. Sell the wood. Buy stone. Not enough gold. Have I got... I, I don't even have any archers. Oh, man. I can't see this working. Can you? Right. We've got the wall in. Can I get the stairs in? Okay, I've got the stairs in. But I need more archers. Why can't I produce troops? Uh, let's turn that down to no taxes. Sell the stone. Sell the wood. They're going to be through that wall in blooming no time. Yep. Get up on this tower. And you two be ready to defend if they come through. Another couple of archers. Come on, guys. Get up on here. Oh, man, 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 man. They're almost through. Here they come. All right, we can just crank, crank out some archers down here. Oh, but look how our archers are just getting slaughtered by... Their archers. Peasants Come on. Come on, guys. You can do it. You can do it. 
just need to keep cranking these archers out and we should survive. Come on, come on, do it, do it, do it. Our archers taking this guy out. Whoa, man, we survived. Woohoohoo! Right, you guys get up on that tower. Right, let's put the uh, rally point up there. Right, now we can actually beef this wall up a bit. Boom. Beef this up. Like, round here. Cool. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna put in a nice beefy wall because I don't want them getting through this. How much more stone have I got? Right there, there we go. Right. Now, um, how are we doing for stuff? Well, we've got loads and loads of wood. We've got loads of stone coming in. We've got a bit of iron coming in. Right. Let's crank out a um, couple of hovels. Uh, those are sixes there. Can I get hovels across there? Yeah, I can. So, hovel there, hovel there, and another hovel there. It's a nice thing about having loads of blooming wood. We can actually get some stuff done now. Right, let's get um, let's get some alternative food sources going. Our apples are good. I'd like to get bread going, but you know what? First, I'm going to put some dairy farms in four of those now let's get some wheat like ideally I'd like to get like yeah one farms must be placed on grassland side oh, two three four right got four wheat farms now that will support um, two mills which will support ten uh, ten bakeries and you know what we can get some cash by selling some candles um, I c you know I could seriously think about putting in a mosque which would make life potentially a bit easier, but you know Not what, we're just going to sell them for now. Right, uh, what else am I going to do? Am I going to get the mill going at this point? No, we haven't quite got enough wood to get the mill going. Um, I am going to crank out you do not have enough gold archers. Woohoo! Okay, we need more gold, so we'll sell some stone, which we kind of don't really need at this point. And um, keep cranking out archers. If we can get a good tower full of archers up here, we'll be potentially in fairly good shape, which would be nice. And I might even get another tower somewhere else. Um, the other thing we could do is put in man traps, which would not be, oh, that would be not a bad idea. Reynolds' men are attacking again. The oh, enemy you know, are attacking right now. Archers first, man traps second. Right, man traps. Let's, you know what? Let's just put in man traps like all along here, because they'll do a fairly. You do not have enough gold to place this oh, building. Oh, gold. Gold needed, sire. Yeah, we'll sell off some stone. Not enough goods. We'll sell off a bit of wood. Uh, while I think about it. Quickly, I'll put in a mill so we can start producing some flour. Good. Right, uh, we'll crank out some more archers. Recruits needed, sire. And uh, I wanted some more man traps, didn't I? Let's spin these around that way. Let's put some. Can't place that there, my lord. By the walls. Yeah, come and come and try and knock my blooming walls down now. You do not have enough gold to place this building. Oh, not enough gold. How we doing? Ha ha ha! It's a bit of a different story this time. Can you guys take out this catapult? Attack. Yes, we can. Good job, guys. Good job. Actually, you know what? I want to bring them in a, a bit closer. I'm going to actually knock those walls down so that any catapults come a bit closer than that. All right, sweet. Oh, man. Who knows, we might be able to actually do this. That would be nice. Right, let's bang some... Um, let's bang some more iron production in. Now, you know what? No. Let's get the candles going. That would be a good plan. Candle makers. Let's put in... Another batch of candle makers. That's eight. That should be enough to support a church. Or, in this case, a mosque. 
Uh, we need 300 gold for that. Which should be no problem if we sell off all of this stone. Oh, we no, no, we need about 100 stone, don't we? Um, we can sell... Oh, we can sell a few candles. There we go. Right, now, can we get a mosque in place? Yes, we can. Can I put it somewhere, like, way out of the way? Yes! Right, so, we've got our mosque in. So now we can crank up religion. Well, we should be able to crank up religion. What the hell? It's working. Uh, we're making candles. The imam is there. Oh, yeah, there you go. Boom. Excellent stuff. How's our food? How's our food going? Uh, oh, food's looking pretty darn good. Oh, if we can get the bakers going, we're going to be in really good shape. Right, so let's get our bakeries going. Where do I want our bakers? Um... I mean, ideally, you want them in between this and the uh, and the granary, but hmm, you know what? One, two, leave a gap. Three, four, five. Um, leave a gap. One, two. What's that? So that's three, six, seven, eight, and let's put two down there. Right. So we've got ten bakers now. Excellent. Alrighty, we can actually start selling some food, you know, potentially. Right, let's um, let's get some sheep farms in. Spin this round. One, two, uh, three, four. Uh, we're going to need more hovels to support these people. Uh, come on, woodcutters, get that wood coming in, will you? You know what? Got loads of stone. Sell stone. I'm really tempted to get a market going. Can I sell a bit of um sell a bit of that? I've almost got enough for a market. Sell a few candles. Come on, give me a bit more stone. If I can get a market going, I'm gonna because it, it'll just make life so much blooming easier. Not so, enough uh, goods. No, nah, you know what? <laughs> it's what it is. Let's let's focus on getting the production up. Let's um, keep increasing our candle makers. So I want one. I want to double the candle production. So let's spin it round that way. And one. We two, need wood, oh, sire. Up, oh, need wood. Buy some wood. And crank up some more candle makers. Oh, how now? Let's spin it around that way. Not enough workers available there. to run this building. Oh, I just screwed up the placement of that one. Never mind. Uh, right, more hovels. Uh, oh, more wood. God dear. You'd think with this many woodcutters that you'd keep up, but you just kind of never do. Okay, a hovel. Come on. I need one wood. Seriously? Come on. Move it. Okay. Right. Um, what else am I going to put? Like, so how, 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 we, how are we doing for food? Growing, Good. We could probably do with a bit more of the sheep. We need wood, sire. Oh, man. Come on, guys. Cut some blooming trees down. Right. Let's try that again. So, I want uh, a couple more sheep farms, and we'll put in a couple more dairy farms. Okay, that should put us in pretty good stead for food production. So, I'm thinking we can probably crank that up to at least normal rations. And I'm thinking we could probably crank it up to double rations to get away with it. We certainly can for now, and uh, that means we can start to crank our taxes up. Let's crank our taxes up to uh, high taxes. That's going to get the gold flowing in, which is beautiful. If we sell this stone, and look at all the candles we're producing, we can crank our services up to three times, which means we could probably afford to go up to very high taxes. Right, let's crank out more archers. 
Oh, I, I think we're looking in pretty good shape now, guys.